All right, guys, Kenny here. It's the uh, second or third day of fall, 2023. And in the driveway, we got a couple of older Cub Cadets, the real Cub Cadets, when International Harvester made them. And uh, this one here is a 1250 Hydro, uh, hydrostatic, uh, manual lift with a spring assist on it. Uh, can't get the engine to turn or anything. I think the solenoid is bad. I got to check that out. But then we have this one here, 149, which I really love because this is the old starter generator type that one's got the regular bendix starter on it but here's the issue this one here came in the engine was stuck i gotta work on the engine but i needed a key for that one didn't have a key so i took the key out of this one i said let me see if it works in the other one and i was able to stick it in and it turned and realized the battery was dead but then i turned it again and uh yeah look what happened yeah not good so anyway when I was getting into these Cub Cadets years ago, a good friend of mine, Hydro Harry Bursell, was leaving the state and moving to Washington State, and he gave me a bunch of keys. And he said, Kenny, he goes, these are basically all the keys you need for the old Cub Cadets, and uh, have at it. And I said, okay. Well, I looked at this key here, the one that was broken, and I said, all right, it's uh, an A1146. It's got the... The diamond with the B on it. What are the chances of having an 1146? So I saw this thing sitting in there and I said, okay, wait a minute. It's got the B on it. What are the chances? Yeah. <laughs> so I said, am I that lucky or what? So I brought it back out and these going upside down. Where are you there? There you go. And perfect. So, thank you to my friend Harry, Hydro Harry Brussel out there in Seattle. The one key that was the same brand as the old one just happened to have the exact same number on it. I know there's not a lot of keys that fit the old Cub Cadets, and I know years later, they went over to this uh, Cole Hershey brand. Um, but then all the newer stuff has regular indat keys, which don't mean anything, but the older ones have a real key with them. So, hey, if you ever see old Cub Cadets in the junkyard and they're throwing them away or whatever, grab all the keys that you can. Or if you see a dealer that used to sell International Harvester or the old Cub Cadets, if he has old keys in the drawer, ask him if you could have them because they will come in handy. This one saved me. Whenever you have old tractors, grab the keys because you never know when you might need them. All right, guys, that's it for now. We'll talk to you soon.